Welcome to the first update of Tropical Storm Greg, a newly formed system in the Eastern Pacific Ocean. It's the seventh named storm of the season so far. And it's currently located at 15.0 degrees north, 108.3 degrees west, about 375 miles southwest of Manzanillo, Colima, Mexico. It has maximum sustained winds of 40 miles per hour and gusting with 50 miles per hour. It has a minimal central pressure of 1,007 millibars and it's moving west-northwest at 9 miles per hour. Tropical storm force winds extend outward up to 35 miles from the center and there are not warnings or watches in effect. The forecast track of the system keeps Greg moving generally to the west-northwest and increasing its speed in the next days. And the forecast says that it will peak as a tropical storm only with 60 miles per hour and then it will start weakening by moving over cooler sea surface temperatures, increasing wind shear and dry air. Right now the sea surface temperatures over Greg are pretty warm, 30 degrees Celsius and Greg will have these conditions within the next 24 to 48 hours until it moves over cooler waters that will cause Greg to start weakening. You can see here as well the Tropical Depression 8E and, Tro and Hurricane Fernanda that, uh, that are about uh, pretty normal conditions 26 to 28 degrees Celsius of sea surface, sea surface temperatures. And about the weather back per loop, you can see the three systems right now. Tropical Storm Greg on the right hand side, pretty disorganized and struggling with the dry air that it that is caused by this mid-level ridge in the atmosphere that is causing all this dry air affecting the system as well. Tropical Depression HE by the influence of Fernanda and that mid-level ridge. The wind shear over Greg is pretty high actually and this is why Greg will struggle with its intensification and maybe that's why it will only peak as a 60 mile per hour tropical storm. The wind shear, wind shear is not expected to decrease over the system, it will remain moderate to high and so Greg will not be a significant storm after all and will dissipate in the next four or five days. And here is the image of the day um, showing the three systems in the Eastern Pacific Ocean. Hurricane Fernanda on the, on the left hand side of the image, Tropical Depression 8E in the center and Tropical Storm Greg in the right hand side. You can see the circulation of Tropical Depression 8E and Tropical Storm Greg being sheared are practically a bit exposed by, by this wind shear that is surrounding the systems. You can follow Force 13 on its outlets. Here is the website force13.co.uk with a tracker every time at your service. Subscribe to the YouTube channel so you will receive notifications at every video we upload in the future. Find us on Facebook, www.facebook.com slash force13 and on Twitter as well to stay updated. You can also add full13 on Skype and an extension 9094 on Discord for tropical weather chat.